is that there's not so many hip hop parties or organic yeah. parties that are happening. Freedom right now. Party is one of like the last one, bro. The last one, yeah, and one it's the still that's been out, for and right. it's still that's going hard, and it's yeah. still going hard. But that's the thing. We 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 got to keep this going to the, for the next generation to continue what we're doing. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? That's what we do it. Right. You know, we're here to 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 help others. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Through art, through music, through dance. Because now I'm seeing the young dancers in circles and I'm loving it. I'm like, yeah, that's what's up. That's but what I, but going back to your art and, and making people feel good about, about it, it's like you put it like over there by the Freedom Towers when you did the flower pots. Oh yeah, yeah. We got. I got hired to, to yes. actually you talk to. About yeah, that. yeah. The yeah. World Trade Center. I got hired to paint to paint the flower pots and uh -huh. shit and and some murals yes. with sixty other artists. Mm -hmm. And the reason we got hired is to make the construction colorful because yes. people go to work miserable looking at gray walls. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So we started painting murals and. And positive messages. So right. when you go to work, you should be like, "Wow, this is dope." See, people be on the ground all day, shit. Like yeah. every day is the same day. Exactly. Do the same thing. Exactly. Take the same train, exactly. Get the same breakfast. Exactly. So now they see something new with murals yeah. and street art. They're like, "Oh, this is dope." Makes me happy to go to work and see some colors. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know I mean? always love how they do. Um, you know, my Houston. Oh, uh, the Bowery the Wall. The Bowery yeah, the Wall. Bowery Wall. Yeah, they change it up with yeah, different artists yeah, all the so. time. So art is important, man. You gotta realize. I tell people, yeah, to buy a piece of artwork, it's not just buying it. It's just for your home. Mm -hmm. It's like you wake up in the morning and you see a piece of artwork, it makes you happy, dude. Like that's what it's about. Mm -hmm. Art. That's what art is about. That's what we do it. We right. do it. Yeah, we gotta eat too mm -hmm. and pay bills. But it's for you to have it in your home and right. you feel good about yourself and, mm -hmm. and be happy to see some colors. You know what I mean? Right. And that's what art is about. So what do you think is your is your next? So uh, when are you doing like another installation with your stuff? Well, I just had a one-man show, uh, my solo show, which yeah. was my first show. I did 89 street art group shows. Uh -huh. And I wasn't ready to do my first solo right, show right. yet. So it took time. And, and the reason I tell artists, take your time because you start building your clientele. Mm -hmm. You start building your collectors to buy your art and understand who you are as a brand. Right. You know what I mean? So yeah. it was this time, now I got a bunch of art dealers and collectors and people that support me mm -hmm. and they will buy my art because right. they follow me. Mm -hmm. It's ridiculous how pe much people follow me that just that tag make art. How many people follow me? Because of how you be doing it. Like, yo, I remember when I went to one of your shows down there by the Lowry. Mm -hmm. and, um, you had the, um, the, the Chanel, the Chanel, Chanel but, piece, like installation. You had the installation because it had the Chanel shoes, it had a Chanel dress, mm -hmm. it had a bag, into the art, mm -hmm. right? That's right, Yo, that's right, for real. And that, then talk about the other one. Remember down there by Second Avenue? Second Avenue. Was it Second in Brooklyn? Down there by Japan Village or whatever, Japanese Village. Wait, what are you talking about? You had an art show over there and I bought the, the painting of the spray Oh, it was called I Am Art. Thank you. I Am Art. Yeah, I Am yeah. Art in Brooklyn. Yeah, yeah. I did that Brooklyn piece. That's how I started doing the 3D letters. Right. Yeah, yeah. That That's was right. a dope show. So you doing, you doing Art Basel this year? No, the only thing is, shout out to Brooklyn Beer Garden. They going out there. You mm -hmm. know, they're a big supporter of street art. So they opened a beer garden and, and why and where is it at? Um, Bushwick. Mm -hmm. It's an outside beer garden right. and they incorporated with street art. Mm -hmm. So he went bomb, we bombed the whole shit of murals mm -hmm. inside the garden. Mm -hmm. So when people go in there, they're like, what the fuck is this? This is dope. Art and beer can't right. go wrong. And then they started, you know, putting little pieces of our artwork to sell. Mm -hmm. And that'd be selling like crazy. So now the Brooklyn Beer Garden is going to Art Basel. So your, and stuff, they, your stuff will be down there though. It's be there when I'm working here. <laughs> So, oh, nice. so they yeah, take it all my shit. Yeah, that's how it works. Exactly. You know? exactly. That's, that's how, how it should works. work. Because you know, I shout out to Art Basel, but you know, I was there. I've been there, done that. But mm -hmm. it's just a, it's just, a, it's just a little dude. Nobody's buying art, man. Mm -hmm. Everybody's just hanging out, looking yeah. at art, and taking pictures with my shit. Yeah. Buy some art, dude. What's yeah. up? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? A lot of that was going on last year. Come that's on, me. dude. That's me. Facts, man. <laughs> Facts on that. Facts on that, man. <laughs> And I and I got pieces from you and yeah, stuff like that. Yeah. But I 
But you know what I'm, I'm saying. Not, yeah, I, I got you. Know, you know, I, just, I just had to. I just <laughs> comment from like an artist point of view. You know what I'm Yeah, we be on that shit and we say, oh, that's nice. That's nice, yo. That's nice. Remember that? We did that all last year. That nigga go like this, yo. That nigga like this, yo. Yo, and we did we Yo, yo, that nigga like this. We, but, yeah, that's, that's nice. nice. Yeah, that's nice, yeah. Yo, that nigga like this, yo, yo. <laughs> That's not high. Right, cool. Then we making a landmark. Like, yo, yo, remember when we said that shit was nice? Yeah, meet me right there. <laughs> <laughs> you know that five thousand dollar pen? Meet me right there. Meet me right there. Either, either that or where's the drinks? No doubt. Yeah. Nah, but it's dope, man. But, but, but the thing is, with the three D art show that um exhibit just, that yeah, you had, yeah. yo, the storyline you had with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, what yeah. you took me. To the, around the journey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's uh, the 3D letter show. It's all my all 3D letters coming out the canvas. Yes. So I wanted to bring that. I wanted to be in your face to look mm-hmm. at it. So I had Brooklyn, I had Harlem, I had Nike, I had Adidas, I had hip hop, I had I love street art, mm-hmm. I had love yourself. So I had two installation doors. But all right. of this, all of this was part of my life. That mm-hmm. I want to tell the story. So we just canvas. Is it something you want to like three stuff? You want to do it again? Yeah, or yeah, yeah. Only, only time. Yeah, this is this is one thing I started doing the three D. So not everybody knows that I'm doing it. Right. But then I'm gonna take the letters to the next level. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. I'll yeah, tell yeah, you yeah, one. Yeah, patent that shit. Oh yeah, I'll tell you one thing. I got one of the letters coming out. The three D letters are gonna be melted. Oh, Put it that way. That's yeah. my next one. Cool. Mm-hmm. So it's different levels of letters yeah. because I'm a mixed media artist. I like to. I could draw and do all that, but I'm a mix me. I love you know, texture. You know, as soon, soon as somebody sees what you're doing. Oh yeah, but that's that's the thing. The replication is coming. Yeah, yeah, that's the thing. That's funny. They already know right. who started the you know the three D right. That's when you have a solo show. They, the whole street art community go. Oh, Sammy's yeah. doing like, that. Like I'm waiting, I can't do that. I'm waiting for the next thing there. Rock that. <laughs> I'm waiting to see it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Fred's gonna get mad, but. I don't. I mean, I'll be like, all right, whatever it is. <laughs> you know, because trans is just really emotional. <laughs> I'm the late back dude. He's like the. Uh, he's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's ready. You know, we need it now for now. Exactly. You know what I'm <laughs> Flappers kind of. Oh, don't God. know why I'm on. Yeah. So, anyway. <laughs> but that's the that's the thing with the art the art world. You right. Know what I mean. Man, it's dope, man. I'm blessed to be working and getting paid what I love to do. Right, mm-hmm. And that's what it's about, man. And I mm-hmm. tell artists, dancers, anybody in the filmmaking industry, whatever, do it. Anything is possible if you put your mind to it. Right. And if I did it, you could do it too. Mm-hmm. Because the only thing that makes me strong and keep going is when I see these kids with no legs or no arms fucking dancing, swimming. Right. That right there, there is no fucking excuse for you to say, yo, I can't do it. I tried. That's Fuck out of here. If you see those kids doing it, you could do it too. That's it. And that's straight that's out true. Talk. That's what makes me that's keep incentive. going. Yeah. yeah, that's what makes me keep going. That's the only thing when I see these children, I have no excuse. Right. So I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep doing it what I'm doing. No, but you should. Because yeah. I mean you I mean you've done so a vast array of stuff. Like I mean you've done videos. I remember one yeah. time you did a video. Yeah. You was going, I forgot where you was going, maybe Miami or something like that. Yeah. I was there, I was a filmmaker for seven yeah. years. Yeah, and I you did. were telling me at Santos, like, yo, I'ma see you later. I'm, like you literally went party and, and then went to get to the place in there. Yep. For a film festival. Yeah, sure. yeah. Yeah, but shout out to Andre Royal. He mm-hmm. was like my, my Robert De Niro. Right. And I was his course. And, and wasn't it something you did with Sadat? Didn't you do a video with Sadat no. or something like that? Me and Talene did a video. We was in that video. Uh for right. what video was it? Uh, well him and P Rock. Yeah. Yeah. I remember that. Yeah, we was just hanging out yeah. and like, yo, come to video. <laughs> But that was, you know, that's that's the fun part about it. It's just have fun, man. Live life, man. Yeah, life is it. too short. Mm-hmm. You know, you're seeing a lot of brothers passing away. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So just, just of our age too. That's yeah, the and our age. And it pisses <laughs> me off. Scary part. Yeah, it's and, like around this time. And it pisses me off that everybody's little by little, man. Like DJs, mm-hmm. dancers, artists. Like I'm just trips me out because we know these cats for a long time. Yeah. Yeah. And we walk together. You don't believe it because you think they're healthy, but they weren't. Mm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So that's why we have to take care of our bodies and, and, right. and eat right and shit like that. But, you know, whatever the universe says to us, it will take me or not. You right. know, you know I'm going to just true. keep going. I'm going to keep going. You know? you know, when your time is up, your time is up. That's you know, just do it right. That's right. Just do it right. You only right. get one chance, you know? Mm-hmm. That's right. And yeah. especially we have the power of the music, the power of the art, and just educate, man. Educate the babies and the children mm-hmm. because that's the future, man. That's, those, are the big, those, are the, those are the ones that are going to take it to the next level. 
You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So I don't care because well, I did my mark, man. I did I did everything I could right now, and and, and I'm gonna keep yeah, going. I mean, you know? You're still building. I'm still building. Yeah, I'm still building. But you have, but you have nothing to prove. Yeah, I, for what, dude? You know what I'm saying? But it's stop fucking hating. <laughs> for real, stop hating. Love each other. Don't hate the next nigga, man. Give him love and respect and learn from him. Love you know what God. I'm saying? Don't judge the book from its cover. Open the fucking book and read chapter one and get to know the dude. Mm. That's real talk. Straight up. Yeah, that's no, there's a there's a lot of hating going on. Yeah, stop that. Stop that shit. We all love each other. Man. They hate us, but they don't. They won't it's tell all right. us. It's all right. Cause they're the they ones that will hug you. Yeah, they won't tell it's us. It's all right. But they probably hate us too. That's, that's all right. right. That's how <laughs> you right. like it. He loves it. It's all right. You know what I mean? That's what that happens. Feel good. Haters so, make you stronger. I feel that like heat. Just remember that. <laughs> Just remember that. Haters make you stronger. You know, that's all it is. We all good, man, because you got to spin it into a positive. Yeah. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. It ain't even hate, son. It's just not understanding Life, yeah. what's going on Life because they want to know. Yeah. But when they not knowing what's the next move and feeling like they out the loop, that's, that's, that's where... That's the problem, man. That's, but, the, that's where the not understanding comes. But you know what the funny shit 